Hello and welcome to another reading from the book, The Faith I Live By, a daily devotional. Today's reading is entitled, Keep Looking Up, August 30th. Looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despising the shame, and is set down at the right hand of the throne of God. Hebrews 12, 2. Several years ago, while journeying from Christiania, Norway, to Gothenburg, Sweden, I was favored with the sight of the most glorious sunset it was ever my privilege to behold. Language is inadequate to picture its beauty. The last beams of the setting sun, silver and gold, purple, amber and crimson, shed their glories athwart the sky, growing brighter and brighter, rising higher and higher in the heavens, until it seemed that the gates of the city of God had been left ajar, and gleams of the inner glory were flashing through. For two hours the wondrous splendor continued to light up the cold northern sky, a picture painted by the great master artist upon the shifting canvas of the heavens. Like the smile of God, it seemed, above all earthly homes, above the rock-bound plains, the rugged mountains, the lovely forests through which our journey lay. Angels of mercy seemed whispering, Look up! This glory is but a gleam of the light which flows from the throne of God. Live not for earth alone. Look up! and behold by faith the mansions of the heavenly home. This scene was to me as the bow of promise to Noah, enabling me to grasp the assurance of God's unfailing care and to look forward to the heaven of rest awaiting the faithful worker. As God's children, it is our privilege ever to look up, keeping the eye of faith fixed on Christ. As we constantly keep him in view, the sunshine of his presence floods the chambers of the mind. The light of Christ in the soul temple brings peace. The soul is stayed upon God. All perplexities and anxieties are committed to Jesus. As we continue to behold him, his image becomes engraved on the heart and is revealed in the daily life. My dear young friends, ever keep Christ in view. Thus only can you keep the eye single to God's glory. Jesus is your light and life and peace and assurance forever. Thank you for listening today. I trust that you have received the message God had in store for you. God's peace be upon you. Maranatha.